okay so i have an interview tomorrow that i am so nervous about i don't want to go but that's where my toxic trait comes in once a year i'll revamp my resume usually in the spring because that's when people are usually hiring i find like early spring you know early summer kind of thing and so i'll revamp my resume re-upload it to like indeed or linkedin you know those type of sites and then companies will reach out to me and then i'll go and i'll ignore them i'll ignore them well not all of them if you're in my price range then you know i'll start to have a conversation or whatever but then there's been plenty of times where i would get interviews and then i'll cancel it for whatever reason it's almost like i'm nervous to you know like when you you you're settled into something and you don't like change or whatever you're too comfortable and the company that I work for right now, it's a great company. It's small. I work at head office. Well, it's not really small. It's under an umbrella of, you know, bigger companies and whatever. But I work at the head office. So there's maybe five people there in any given day. Um, I have my own office. They're pretty flexible with me because when COVID, you know, like during COVID, any little cough or any little sniffle that the kids got oh it's a covid symptom and they have to stay home for 14 days and whatever whatever and my company was there for me they allowed me to take the time off they didn't really you know they didn't really hassle me that much and kind of thing if in the middle of the day my kids school or the daycare calls oh something's wrong they need to be picked up I would leave and I'll go pick them up or whatever. I'll just tell my supervisor, I, I got to go, blah, 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 whatever. But I need more money. Like, don't get me wrong. They, they, my phone has went back on the dashboard. I can't fix it. But anyways, every year I get a raise or whatever. But I need more money. I need more money. In the world that we live in right now, and that's why another reason why I can't afford a house because I'm a single parent household. It's only one income. And I could never afford a home on my own with just one income. But regardless, I just need more money. The the interview that I have for tomorrow, it's between a five and six thousand dollar increase than what I'm getting now. I really don't want to go like I'm feeling to just cancel but I spoke to the owner yesterday and he seemed pretty he seems okay so I think I'm gonna go and just see how it plays out even if I do get the job you know and they're paying more money I'll have to outweigh the the pros and the cons am I gonna get my own office what are the hours because right now I work Monday to Thursday, 8.30 to 5. And then on Fridays, I work 8.30 to 1. So I get half a day on Fridays. Is it going to be the same at this new company? Are you? Do you guys have a pension plan? Do you pay into RESP, you know, retirement savings plan? Do you do all of that? So I'm nervous about that interview. And how do I go into the interview? Do I go in with my bald head? Or do I wear a wig? And then after I get hired, I just you know rip it off and be like boom this is me take it or leave i'm being dramatic but i don't know i'm so i hate doing job interviews that's another thing because a lot of the times a lot of the times they'll ask me a question and i know the answer but in the moments like i'm so nervous i can't put together a sentence to answer them properly after the interview now i'm like oh my god no that's not what i should said this is what i should have said kind of thing or whatever but wish me luck for tomorrow okay and i'll let you guys know how it goes that's if i don't cancel which i'm not going to i'm not going to <laughs>